is. I want watches... to say a denizen is like an outsider or someone that comes from somewhere, like hails from somewhere. I, yeah. don't, I don't know the difference. Because like, I've seen Kirby like, labeled as Thoughts that's, Venom. That's such a useless, that would be such a useless word then. Well, it's just to sound fancy. It's like saying pugilist instead of boxer. I mean, I guess there might be a difference there. No. Uh-oh. That was pretty good. So this is Dumb Shiny, right? Um, He's yes. fighting Venom. Yeah. Yeah, so this isn't bad for D2D. Um, it's about 50-50. I would say so. It's at least winnable, regardless of if any character specifically has an advantage. Because, like, D2D can, like, tank a lot of hits from Falcon. Like, he can live uh -oh. reasonably. Oh, that could have been dangerous. Is he going to get the read? No, he doesn't even go for it. I think one thing that makes D2D a really fundamentally good character is that he has the ability to throw you off, and if he guesses your recovery option two or three times, you are guaranteed dead regardless of who you are. Yeah. You know, some characters, it's like, as it's Ivysaur, sort of I have a hard time edge guarding some people and have an easy time against others. Yeah. But D2D has a universally pretty easy time. Or at least like, it's always possible. Because, like, not only is he, like, he has a lot of jumps, so that already makes him really good at edge guarding, but he's also got possibly one of the biggest disjoints in this game. Ooh. Dang. Yeah, I think... Oh, not quite. Disjoint helps off stage, it's, but only if you're like swinging it in an arc. Because I Especially believe, in an arc. I think the thing that makes a character good at edge guarding or not is how much area your character can paint in red off stage in yeah. about like maybe you know, one, a, four, one, a, a third of a second. Yeah. I mean, D -D -D Pit, Pit has Disjoint, right? But his fair is not a particularly good like offstage edge guarding tool. No, it, because it, it only hits, hits the one arc, like in front of him. Yeah, it just hits the small area in front of him, and only for a second, too. But DDD's fair, you can... DDD covers high and low, and in front of. And the fact that it like goes low first, I feel like that helps even more. Mm -hmm. So Like, somehow I think that's a little better. Yeah. But, I mean, Ike's got a pretty good edge guard, and he hits it upwards, so we'll line up. In this matchup, it's a... Uh, very important to have solid punishes on Falcon, and I don't know if Dumb Shiny's really gotten any near zero to deaths. Not really. I haven't seen... He did... He's... He's not getting too many conversions off of grabs. Like, I would have wanted to do an up throw at this percent. I see Arcanine. He's playing sort of non-aggressively in neutral. Like he, there's a lot of times when I would expect anyone to throw at an attack, and he just won't for some reason. Ooh, DDD or... The, uh, ooh, that, dumb, was a, dumb Shiny. that was a nice option. All right. I don't know what he should hopefully kill him. That oh, should, nice. Yeah, yeah. should have been it. If you recognize that they're up being high, most uh, most of the cast gets destroyed by DDD. Oh. Uh, yeah, because he's got the jet hammer. Yeah. It's like if you're fighting a DK whose up B takes so long, then I just start uh, charging it down B the moment I see them go high. What oh, is that? You got to fight uh, Kpum next on stream. Next. Oh, next on stream? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, against that Mario. I'm not sure hmm. where. Whatever. I All right, I was so up soon, but oh well. both Green Hill and Fountain are gone. Those were Lucky's bands, right? Yeah. I'm not sure why. Well, Fountain maybe I understand, but I'm not sure why Green Hill. I mean, at Green Hill, I would probably pick that as D2D. I just like that Sage's D2D yeah, in general. True. You can Especially get a lot against of fast forward really early edge guards. Yeah, almost any stray hit can lead into an edge guard. Oh no. Ooh, oh, nice that was wait. very good patience. Yeah, that was the one way out, and he found it. Okay. Oh, I want to leave. Yeah, Lucky's playing really I think confidently. That I think that should have been a, a back air. DDD would have been able to go for it. Oh, no. Just, like, dropping with Falcon there would have been the correct option with another back air. This is, uh, he's not going... I don't think he's going deep enough. Or, like, at least off Dumb stage shiny? enough. Yeah. Because, yeah. like, he, was, he jumped off stage, but then he grabbed the ledge. Yeah, fair in general, a... you know, is stronger and more rewarding to hit off stage. But if you want the safe option... Ooh, that was you could wait on stage, maybe down tilt. Um, maybe, alternatively, off stage, a fast falling back air usually can cover high and low simultaneously pretty well. Ooh, that was good. No inhale. That was that'll do it. That was a dangerous spot to use inhale too, because the waddle D was there. Yeah. And that could have stunned him for quite a bit, uh, quite a long time. Yeah. I don't know what that was. Yeah. All right. He needs to finish this. No, he guesses incorrectly. Yeah. Misplaces his back air. Because like the l the later percent it gets, the more difficult it gets to edge guard characters. I think. Now he's taking like. He's taking a he lot might, of might a lot of unnecessary percents right now. This might be a whole stock because he missed that edge guard. Uh, I don't think waddle these are what you need right now. Waddle these are good for getting things started, but you need to finish something. 
nope. DDD is not good. DDD is not good at finishing the job himself. He's got to make someone else do it. All right, so you can prevent the four stock. Just uh, any. Got to get one fair. Any aerial, really. Yeah, that'll do it. There we go. All right, there we go. No four stock. No JV. I don't want to see a JV. I don't know. Okay, good. There we go. I mean, he could actually bring this back because the way it's DDD definite, functions is very gimp-heavy. It's definitely gimp -heavy. doable, but I don't think he's going for a lot of gimps right now. Like, yeah. I'm not totally sure. He definitely sure. needs to. I'm not totally sure what he was aiming to do right there. This is probably a good motivator. Ooh, not quite. Jab didn't come out fast enough. All right, yeah. Up tilt Ooh. might have worked, but it was just misplaced, mistimed. Down tilt, nope, neither. Forward tilt, it's not going to do anything at that percent. Yeah, Dumb Shiny really just needs to uh, be more scary by the ledge. Yeah, because, like, he's not the... Well... Cause like he's getting him off stage, but like right there he could have hit him. Yeah. Well, that was very very interesting. I All don't right. know how to feel about that. That was a three stock. I think I'm up. So. Yeah, you're up. Cool. I